Now, what you want to be careful is those teeth really hurt being from the discarnate. <laughs> and if it's under tension, then you have to so, let's take my cutters off. So, I might need to come back a little. Yeah. Oh, very fancy. Cam snapper. But you know what? It's not going to work. Because even if you. I think the warp is what we did. It's like you take it, like, okay, I'll say and how it is. So let's see if we That's I feel like the um idea of we need light scenes. Like we can kinda see this guy, but Yeah, this is a pretty dark one. Yeah. And then and then I have to reprogram it again. Very immersive. Look at all these crystals and things. Very dark scene though. What's, the, uh, what's going on in the top corner? Is that the UV stuff? Yeah, that's the UV mapping weirdness. Basically, um... Do we need to copy it over to a different... We would just need to remap it with everything in view. The problem is when we did the UV or the UV setting for like all the children and things, um, alpha values. And as a result, yeah, it like doesn't see anything. A lot of it will come down to as far as what you see in the scene is like designing right? Oh, does it? It imports it and then it creates what's called TAG files. Um, so yeah, we probably won't need that. <laughs> but what we can do is. Find that OBJ. Bring it in. Thing like a voice spinning. Yeah. Well, what would be cool. Is not even first person. Is um. I wonder. You know what's interesting is what this says it sees is actually like more than what that sees. Yeah, yeah, because that still has the um old geometry that oh, it's projecting on. I see. I see. Yep. Um, what was I going to say? The, uh, what I would, what I think we should try is, like, putting the UI elements in and just see what happens. It's interesting to read from here, because you kind of, it does, like, sort of kill the perspective trick if you're trying to, like, read text, because you're not staring at the center anymore. It's part of the problem. So you can, I think, definitely have text in the center, but having text on the side like that. It would probably be more legible. Oh yeah, absolutely. So that's just like something to think about when like you're actually designing um, projects for this. So, so did you scale it there? And be like differently? Yeah. So it seems like because we have such like a wide, um, in terms of like horizontal field of view, yeah. like 180 degrees, we actually will have to like stretch all of our UI to actually match that. Kind of work. Mm-hmm. It'd be on the small side, but that would be like the smallest text you could do probably. I got you, Carlos. Oh, space. In my giant tablet. So, I was like, no, I'm not taking any more videos. <laughs> <laughs>